sum that one up? Um, obviously we're all gutted. Um, we've performed really well, created a lot of chances, by far the better team. And then um, they've just scored two worldies and, you know, we feel like we should have won. You can't legislate for their goals, can you? You can't, there's no blame on, on, on any crew player really. That's no. just top draw strikes. Yeah, two unbelievable strikes. Um, the first one, maybe I could, I, I should have shown him outside, but um, and I've let him come inside, so I, sh I should have done a bit better on that. And then, but still, it's two unbelievable strikes. There's not much you can do. But the way that you got yourselves two 0 up was thoroughly deserved as well, wasn't it? You know, two really well crafted goals, one for you uh, and one for Chris Porter. Yeah, um, we played really well the whole game, um, especially the first half. We We've played some great football, created a lot of chances, you know, we should have been maybe three or four up at half time. And then I've had another chance early on in the second half where I probably should have scored. So yeah, um, we can't take anything away from our performance because uh, I, I, I thought we were really good today. You're in a sequence of fixtures against all the sides that are around you in the table and those up at the top. How yeah. much does it give you though that you know that there's still something to play for when you've, you've more or less should have taken the game away from, from Sutherland and teams like that that you've been playing of late as well? Um, yeah, obviously it's, I suppose it is a confidence boost, you know, the way that we've played against these top teams, you know. I think, um, I think these have got the best, the best away record in the, in the league. So that should be our hardest game at home, and we've, we've performed really well. But yeah, we're all just gutted that um, that we haven't won the game. As a player, though, to see where you are and where you're making the progress—that's what it's all about, is it? Individually, you're all making progress, and as a team, you're all making progress. Yeah, um, I think uh, the game against these at home, um, at their place. Uh, Obviously, we, it shows how far we've come since then. Um, so yeah, we're still all getting better, and we we know that um, there's there's still more to go. We can still um, we still perform better. We can still win more games. We all know that we can all still improve. Is it a matter of reflecting Saturday night and thinking a little bit about it on Sunday? But come Monday, it's gone, and you get back on on with the job in hand of you know your next game and being at Blackpool. Yeah. Um, we're all disappointed now, and um, but you know we've got to, we've got to get it out of our system, uh, take the positives from our good performance, and you know we go again on Tuesday, and uh, it's another big game. Yeah, playing sides like Blackpool, who had an excellent win over the weekend, you know all about their manager Neil Critchley would have dealt with him, of course, when you're yeah. in the academy, so you'll know what's coming. But it's a game that you know you've got nothing to lose and go for it. Yeah, we've got nothing to lose. You know, there's no pressure on us. Um, We've all got that belief that you know we can perform against any against the best teams in this league against anyone. Um, so yeah, we've got to go into that game with the same belief and same confidence that we've shown today, and uh, hopefully we can get a, a result.